Hi everyone, welcome back to another After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create crystal logo animation. Our first step is to create main composition. Import logo image inside the After Effect. Make sure your logo image is in PNG format. Create a new solid layer. Go to toolbar and select ellipse tool. If you not find ellipse tool, press Q button on the keyboard and it will show. Create circle mask on the solid layer. Expand the mask property of the solid layer and add a keyframe of mask expansion. Make sure you are at the first frame in the timeline then move forward around 5 seconds and add a keyframe. Change the mask feather value to 80. Apply an effect called Rough Edges on this solid layer. And also apply an effect called Mosaic. Change the horizontal block to 150 and vertical block value to 30. Select both layers and pre-compose them. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus C. Call it Inside Logo. Select the Inside Logo composition and press Ctrl plus D for duplicate the compositions. Select First Composition. Apply a effect called Difference Mat. Change the Difference layer to Second Inside Logo composition. Set Tolerance value to 1, softness value to 0.1 and before difference value to 1. Apply another effect called cell pattern. On this first inside logo composition, change the contrast value to 120, change cell pattern type to crystals HQ, set size value 80 and disappears value 1.5. Press Alt plus right click on the evolution for writing the expression. And write this time expression for random movement of the pattern. Now apply an effect called CC Vector Blur to give it a glossy look. Set amount value to 130 and angle 30 and softness value to 0. Apply Triton effect for the color. Apply a deep glow effect to make it glow brightly. Also apply explosion effect to look bright as well. Change master to individual channels. And set the red and green exposure to 1. Increase the radius value to 800 of the deep glow effect. Now 
now we are creating floor select both composition recompose them called final logo now we are creating floor create a new solid layer called floor for creating floor i am using fractal noise effect apply this on the solid layer change noise type to block contrast value set to 180 and brightness value set to minus 40 make this floor solid layer to 3d just press the 3d icon of the layer and place this layer something like that also pre compose this layer make sure check the move all attributes select the final logo composition and press control plus d for duplicate this layer select the first composition right click go to transform and select flip vertical place this composition just under the logo like that create adjustment layer and place this adjustment layer in between the both composition select the adjustment layer and apply a effect called compound blur change blur layer to floor and maximum blur value to 200 also change the opacity value of the second final logo composition as well our logo our logo animation is almost done Now just add the camera here for zoom out in animation. Right click, go to new, select camera. Make sure all these compositions 3D. Just click on the 3D icon. Also create null object for operating this camera tool. Select the null object and press S for the scale property. at keyframe of the scale change value to 75 move forward at the end of the timeline then change scale value to 100 this is our crystal logo animation i hope you learned something new from this video your subscriptions and likes are great motivation from me to create new tutorials thank you